ladies and mostly gentlemen, today we're going to take you back to World of Warcraft Classic and a questline which I fondly remember doing back in the day and uh, we're going to go through it today because not that many people really know it exists. Uh, so for me personally, I first found out about this back in the day when I was level 20 and I was in Lotmodan questing, which is one of my favorite zones. Uh, headed down to the southernmost part to find a gate which was locked to a place that I had no idea. You know, I, I had no idea about Searing Gorge. I had no, literally this is like the first time I'd ever played the game. So like this just just something that doesn't happen anymore. So this door was locked and I just accepted that I'll never get through it. So obviously it turned out there was an alliance only quest line to get the key which will let you get through the gate to Searing Gorge. This used to be really important and very crucial for you to get because there didn't used to be a flight point in uh, Searing Gorge, Thorium Point came in about in patch 1.5, I believe. So before that, it was very important. But since Thorium Point come in, not so important, but it's still something cool to get, uh, you know, just as a tidbit of classic WoW. So when you're around level 50 to 60, head over to the southernmost point of Lotmodan once again and speak to Mountaineer Pebblebitty. Now she's pretty damn stubborn. She will not let you through this gate at all. And um, basically what she wants you to do is go to Searing Gorge through the Badlands, because that was the only way to get there, and kill a specific NPC. And she wants you to bring back something from that NPC to prove that you've actually killed it. So you head through the Badlands, it's obviously a very Horde contested zone, and head to this point in the bottom right hand corner of Searing Gorge. Once you're there, you will find a patrolling Thunder Lizard known as Margul the Rager. Now Margul patrols near this cave and is one tough cookie. It's a level 48 elite with around 6,000 health, so either bring a party or solo it yourself. Once you kill her, she'll drop Margul's Horn, and this item begins a quest. Now this quest is called the Horn of the Beast. And the quest text is just great. It says that in the horn, there is a metal object lodged inside it. And it turns out that the metal object is actually an axe. And there are some words etched into the axe, which say property of Mountaineer Pebblebitty. So what you gotta do is take it back to Mountaineer Pebblebitty and the southernmost part of Lochmodan. So you can either fly from Thorium Point if it's in Classic WoW at launch, or run through the Badlands back to Lochmodan. Now, once you finally make it back to Mountaineer Pebblebitty, she still is not convinced. You give her the horn, she still says no. And the reason for this is because she thinks it's a fake. She says that she's been face to face with Margul, and she knows for a fact that the horn is at least eight times larger than the one that you've got. So unfortunately, she still doesn't give you the key to Searing Gorge. But what she does do is she gives you a chance. She says, take the horn to create a Thoris in Ironforge so he can validate whether or not the horn is real or fake. And once you've done that, bring the proof back to her. So you make your way from Lotmodan through Dunmoreau to Ironforge to speak to Creator Thoris, who is in the Hall of the Explorers. Now you give him the gigantic horn that you just looted. He says that it is indeed the real horn of Margul the Rager, and it gives you the proof of deed to give back to Mountaineer Pebblebitty to prove to her that you did actually kill that NPC in Searing Gorge. So once again, you head back to the southernmost part of Lot Modan and speak to Mountaineer Pebblebitty one last time, and hand in the quest at last. She says that she can't believe it that someone as weak as you could actually kill Margul the Rager, but a deal's a deal and she gives you the key to Searing Gorge. And that's it. A small quest line, a really cool quest line that just takes you around a few zones and takes you on a little adventure and honestly that is what Classic WoW is all about. And now you can make your way through the tunnel to Searing Gorge from Lot Modan and if you bring some friends they can come along with you as well which is great, no phasing or sharding or anything like that. It's simply epic. So guys, that's pretty much it. Let me know down below what you think of this quest line if you've never heard of it before. Uh, let me know if you think this is a cool one. I really do enjoy this one. It, as I said, close to my heart. I remember doing it back in the day and uh, it's a good one. It definitely is. So uh, yeah, before I go guys, I'd like to give a massive shout out to my amazing patrons, YouTube channel members and Twitch subs. You guys are awesome. If you'd like to support the channel in any of those ways, links are down below. So leave a like on this video guys if you liked it and subscribe if you haven't. I've also got a partner to your channel with over 3,000 members and a merch store over on Streamlabs. I'm also now streaming on twitch.tv slash mrgm if you want to check me out on stream. We'll be doing a lot of PTR content stuff and viewer raids and all sorts of fun stuff. So guys, twitch.tv slash mrgm if you want to check me out there. And with that, I'll see you next time.